This pre-calculus, uh, topic eight, this is the very last problem on the practice assessment. And uh, the directions here say, set up a system of equations in order to find the cubic equation that matches this set of data. Um, you do not need to solve the system uh, or find the equation. We just need to write a system for it. So first off, we know it's cubic. So I know that cubics look like uh, ax cubed plus bx squared plus cx plus d equals y. And here I have a bunch of xy combinations. So for example, when x is 3, y is 49. So let me plug that in. So I have uh, 3. So I have 3 cubed times a plus 3 squared times b. Notice I'm putting it into the x spot. Plus 3 times c plus d equals my y value of 49. And uh, if I plug in the next one, 4, uh, 4 cubed times a plus 4 squared times b plus 4 times c plus d equals 102. I can keep going from here. Um, I want to note, though, I have 1, 2, 3, 4 unknowns. So that means I'm going to need four equations, and I, I need to list all four of them. So I'm going to use four points here. So 5 cubed, I'm just going to actually start evaluating these. 5 cubed is 125. So 125a plus 5 squared, 25, plus 5 times c, plus 1d equals, 5 is associated to 195. And if I plug in the 6, uh, 6 cubed is 216, plus 6 squared, 36b, plus 6c, plus d and 6 is associated with 340. Let me go back and clean these up. Uh, 3 squared is 9. 3 to the third is 27. 4 cubed is 64. And 4 squared is 16. There's my system right there. You don't even need to write it as a matrix. There it is. Uh, if you didn't want to solve it, you could shove it in your calculator, run it through your matrix menu, or you could do it by hand. But you don't need to solve it. Just, just write the system. So. Look at that gorgeous arrow. There it is.